yeah, Riley and Gavin. Oh, is Riley here? How are you guys? It's good to see you again. What's that? Oh, she made this necklace in Sunday school. Is that your name on there? What does it say on there? What? What does WWJD stand for? Yeah, what would Jesus do? Well, that's a powerful thought, isn't it? What would Jesus do? I wonder what he would say if he was here this morning. I wonder what he would be like. I want to ask you a question. Did you guys uh, work for a store and then they paid you money and then you went to the grocery store and you bought the food that you have in your refrigerator? Did you guys do the work to get the money to buy the food that's in your refrigerator? You, you did help at Aldi's. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Did you guys earn money? Did you get money so you could pay the rent or pay the, so you could buy a house to live in? Did you guys do that? Your dad bought the house. What about, uh, what about that sunshine that comes through that beautiful window? What about that sunshine that comes through that beautiful window? Can you make that happen? Yeah. You know what? There's so much that we just can't do, isn't there? But it really blesses us. That's called, in the Bible, grace. It's something that comes from outside us and is really good for us. It builds up our lives. It blesses us. It saves us. Grace all comes from Jesus because you couldn't make, you couldn't, uh, you couldn't make Jesus happen. Jesus is a person and he came and he happened to you. Just like the sun comes and you don't make the sunshine. Kind of like the food on your table at home. You don't make that happen, do you? You might help, but it's, it's your ma, your dad who who makes the money and then he brings the food. He does that for you. Jesus does so many things for us that we can't do for ourselves. Jesus brings grace. Isn't that wonderful? Lord Jesus, we thank you that your grace comes to us through many, many ways. We thank you that your grace comes to us through, through parents and grandparents and aunts and uncles and, and people who love us, who do things that are powerful in our lives, do build up goodness and safety and provision in our lives. We thank you, Lord, for your grace. And we thank you most of all for your great grace that we don't deserve, we didn't make happen, that comes to us in Jesus Christ our Lord and Savior. Thank you, Jesus. In your name I pray. Amen. Thanks for talking to me. And remember, what would Jesus do?